Hi, it's Ray from LoveYourRV.com again, and today um, we're going to do something not RV related. We're up here in Campbell River for the summer on Vancouver Island, and one of the reasons we like to stay at an RV park here is um, Anne likes to put her boat Snoopy in the water, and she can moor it just 10 minutes away from uh, Thunderbird RV. So today, um, I'm going to go with her. I'm not really much of a boater, but every once in a while I like to get out on the water. And we're going to go over to a really cool place called Desolation Sound. It's in a marine uh, park not too far away from here. And it's a gorgeous day today, nice and calm. Looks like it's going to be maybe hit about 80 degrees. So uh, I'll give you some highlights here. Stay tuned. Fueling up the Snoopy boat, getting ready at the fuel dock here. It's like lots of big commercial uh, fishing boats are in waiting for the season to open up here. I'll show you the, the route we're taking. We started up here in Campbell River and we came down and this is the last little choppy bit I videotaped. We're bouncing around. There's a lot of current flows through there. Now we're out in the nice part where it's all nice and calm. So we're going to head over here and up into what's called Desolation Sound. And up here there's a little place called Refuge Cove. It's kind of a little harbor, and we might get some lunch up there. So uh, let me show you that from where we're headed. Okay. So those are kind of the coast mountains and a lot of the islands over there. And we're going to go right up over in, in amongst those mountains up there. Once we get into there, the scenery should be pretty spectacular with those uh, jagged peaks of the... BC Coastal Range over there. You can see it's quite calm. Some other boats going by. A lot of marine traffic goes through here. It's one of the reasons we like it up here. We can watch all the boats go through because every boat that comes on the inside of Vancouver Island has to pretty well navigate through a, a couple narrow areas and that's one of them is the Discovery Passage that goes by Campbell River. Campbell River where we've come from back there so yeah it looks like it's turning out to be a nice day had a little rain this morning but it's starting to clear up really nice so it should be a good trip there we are there's a nice boat moving by and these mountains you see over here that's Vancouver Island Okay, we've been uh, motoring along for about a half an hour now and we're entering the Desolation Sound area. You can see the really cool uh, mountains on the BC Coast side there. So we're going to probably motor up in there and explore some of the, the inlets and fingers. It's really neat, the mountains come straight down to the water. But uh, first, I think we're just going to go to a little uh, place, uh, Refuge Cove, and have some lunch. Hopefully the sun will come out soon, because it's a lot more spectacular when you get some light on, on this scene. It's a little dull today. You can see all the sailboats. This is very popular in the summer. People come and uh, sail and motorboat around here. They anchor and stay overnight. It's like... Uh, Camping for boats. Okay, Captain, start her up. There 
we go, there's where all the garbage goes. Dave's Garbage and Recycling. Get yourself a garbage barge. Oh, that's a good job. You can always have business. This is Refuge Cove. Got a nice uh, general store in there for all the boaters. And there's kind of a gallery gift shop. And you can stop and get espresso, coffee, hamburger, stuff like that, wraps. It's kind of a vital little link for all the, the people around Desolation Sound. They can get their mail here, liquor store, gas, all kinds of stuff. And the airplane flies in and out of here with parts and supplies, stuff like that. And it's like a little uh, community that lives here. I guess all year round, but it's quite the going concern in the summer. A little protected cove. Okay, we've made our lunchtime destination of Refuge Cove. Anne's up there in the little uh, coffee shop kind of lunch outfit. It's kind of a neat little place. It's like the general store. It's all the boats that are uh, camping in, in the Desolation Sound come here to uh, get supplies, have a snack. There's a little uh, marina in here. Kayakers. Funky. Refuge Cove, thanks for the burger. Well, that was a nice stop at Refuge Cove for a burger, a little hangout. Now while uh, we're uh, having lunch, the skies have opened up and it's sunny and gorgeous. So we're going to head right up into there, explore that inlet up there and some of the Desolation Sound Marine Park. Beautiful day. So here we are, right in one of the inlets in Desolation Sound. Gorgeous. A lot of boats uh, anchored. There goes a nice boat. It's like the Swedish flag on the front. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah, this is super popular for summer boating up here. You can see why. Nice sheltered inlet. Beautiful scenery. Yeah, it's spectacular coast mountains as a backdrop. Woo! Supernatural British Columbia, they call it. And this is why. That guy 
is brave. I can't be that warm of water. He's on like a surfboard. Holy cow. Yeah, but not like warm, warm. Okay, so here's the entrance to the marine park. You can see all the boats anchored. Such a pretty spot. There's boats everywhere. This is a really good anchorage. Yeah. Pretty crowded. Wow. Very popular. Very popular. Oh, that guy's great. Desolation sound. Eventual, uh, Park. Wow, look at that thing. Now that's a nice boat. Oof. Oof, oof. Get all their anchors out and their bows tied. Bows are turned, stern. They're stern tied. Stern tied. That's cool. This is a really sheltered little inlet here. Just cruising. He must be burning a gallon of every 30 seconds in that sucker. Well, we had a nice afternoon in Desolation Sound. 
we're headed back. You can hear that uh, boy clanging. Clang, clang. Guess that's good in the fog, eh? That's what it's for. It's super calm right now. Wow. Dead calm. Gorgeous. Get him. Chili. The big jellyfish. Gonna go under. Uh oh. It's gonna stick to the boat. Get him. Ooh. A jelly. So bizarre. So we're almost back to Campbell River. We're just stopped off the end of what they call uh, Quadra Island. And this is a super hot fishing spot. Find all sorts of guys out here now. Right now there's lots of salmon in the waters. They call Campbell River the salmon capital of the world scan over this way. Look at all the boats. This is a really popular fishing spot here. A lot of the, I see a lot of the lo local lodges and hotels. They'll run the people down here in the boats so they can uh, catch the big salmon. Look at them all. I just thought I'd show you this little RV park that's on Quadra Island. It's right down near the end, what they call Cape Mudge, near the lighthouse. I think it's affiliated with a, a resort. I'll uh, put a link up. Looks like a really cool little place to camp. You have to take the Quadra Island ferry to get over here. But uh, from the looks of it, there's some fairly large fifth wheels in there. We camped once there, I guess it was almost 10 years ago in our camper van. It was awesome. Just camp right on the beach there and watch all the boat traffic go by. Because you're right on the Discovery Passage here. There's the Discovery Passage. And over that way all along there is Campbell River. So it's really a cool spot. That expert docker. Wow. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, look, because there is a boat over there. <laughs> yeah. There we go, the end of a fine day. Uh oh, here comes the Coast Guard. He saw you dock. There we go. Back at the RV. Nice drink in hand. Cheers. End of a fine trip over to Desolation Sound.